Ooh, what is up guys and welcome to our week 8 TBU game against of course Dan Which is a very very monstrous player And uh, looking to this team here, we are seeing things here that could throw me off uh, I really feel that he's gonna lead with either Reggie Rock or predicts that Dom is gonna be lead and therefore bring uh, The monster that is um, Ooh, what, what do you call it? Uh, Greninja Greninja could also be a Sash set. That is very, 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 very possible. Um, yeah, with that said, I think I'm going to lead off with Lothan anyway. Because I kind of get my rocks up no matter how I pull it. Even since uh, the monster is bringing is not involved with what I was thinking. So Jonathan is the best lead here. And there we go. He brings Jin here, which of course is uh, thunderous. Um, he's gonna go for Grass Knot, there is really nothing to it. Uh, I gotta go for Stealth Rocks anyway. Since there's no way of actually taking them away, uh, while Grass Knot pushes us down to Sturdy, at least I can... I get my rocks up, which is really, really fortunate. Uh, one kind of issue here is that he could bring Jardos. Goes for Nasty Plot, nice. That is, uh, that is unfortunate. Um, Alright, let's see if we can go for a Stone Edge then and try to hurt him a little bit. Hidden power, and I see the power ice, of course. Life orb, right? Nice. Uh, there we go. There we go. All right, that worked. Uh, that worked. Uh, luckily for me, I have eye shots. I can just kind of pick him out. Since it's dead anyway, you can't switch out and save it. <sighs> Dear Lord, that was um, that was a lead. That was a lead for sure. That could have turned real ugly. Um, all right, so. Um, I mean, what would you know? Like, Regirock is uh, is a thing. Jardos is a thing. Greninja is obviously a thing. Um, there is nothing... Like, he doesn't really lose anything by... Uh, by going for a Dark Pulse here. I have no mod that really takes that well. Um, and with Stab and all, it's gonna hurt. Hmm. I guess I could preserve this. Like the priority is nice, but it won't really happen too much here in the way. So I'm just going for ice shot and do whatever he likes. Really, um, goes to ice beam. That was actually kind of surprising. Didn't see that one coming. Um, right, go for God of War, and I got trace torrent. Of course, that master's ability really. Um, could I lock myself into thunder? Balls. I shouldn't. Really shouldn't. Moonblast is the way to go. Uh, I think so, at least. Like, my damage output is really high. The question is, how high can it be? Um, come on, make the call, make the call. I really, really want to go through his head. See, he goes for, all right, Lord Dragon, whatever. And yeah, that that stung. That really stung. Hopefully he's not scarfed himself. Hopefully he's not scarfed himself. That's the, really all I can go with. Uh, all right, so that one goes down. Um, very straightforward right now. Um, let's see, Ridge Rock is an issue, Embor is actually an issue, Embor will always be an issue actually, uh, there is the Embor, the bacon, it's the only thing I can do, and uh, he has to go for Flare Blitz to get that damage output, so with that in mind, I am the smarter player by going for, it depends on his set though. Yeah, Stoutland might be smarter, since I've Intimidate on Stoutland. Uh, if you go for Superpower, then so be it. At least I get Intimidated, which is always helpful in this situation. Um, because if it has Earthquake, then uh, my Volcano will not take two of those. A Volcano is somewhat usable against Reggie Rock and uh, Odino, while this Bacon Mon is uh, manageable. I do outspeed it if it's a Scarf set, but... I really want to gauge the damage. Uh, I kind of want to find out what it's all about. Um, I mean, that's the best call I can do. I think. 
All right, he's really thinking about this. Go forth, which of course his name is Southland here. All right, goes with superpower or flare blitz. I mean, um, we don't see any kind of residual damage there, which is kind of nice. Um, there are no reason for me not going for Thunder Wave here, actually. Um, It's nice having that one intimidated. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's scarfed. Uh, should be said actually. Um, actually, he's Odino. He's gonna go to Odino anyway. And uh, yeah, that's the thing though. Like, oh, oh, this works even better. Uh, since I go for Thunderway with that anyway, and his team is rather slow at this point, it actually doesn't really matter. Um, so I'll go for Steam Eruption, that should kill it. Uh, so it doesn't get rocks up, which is like super important. Um, that at least it wasn't banned, and now we know it's scarfed. And I think next time it comes in, it's definitely an area where um where sorry, that where Guard of War should be able to take that one out. Um Red's gonna switch that out and go to Greninja, which I don't think can survive this hit. <laughs> Actually it does. Actually it does. It, uh, all right, um, jam. That's unfortunate. Um, here's the deal, though. Um, here's the deal. Um, like he dies to life for basically, or actually he can't survive the next hit. He's gonna pull. Um, he has to go for dark pulls. I don't have a mod that necessarily resists that. Uh, at least not properly. Yeah. Damn. Damn, 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 damn. I have no mods that want to take this damage. Incoming Dark Pulse. Come on. Make the call, Chris. Make the call. How healthy do you need Volcanion? That is where it is. Actually, Rock Tomb. That actually works. That is okay, then. A bit surprised by that, to be honest. But that works. Actually, why did I think it was Life Orb? Gosh, I wonder. Alright, so Big Boy Man is going to come back out. And... Um... Alright. It's time for Sephtal, then. He's going to go for Rocks, I'm sure. Uh, Stone Edge, even. Oh, and that stings. That really, really, really stings. So, all I can do from here is Leaf Storm. Uh, and he's gonna lose this monitor process. Actually, Giga Drain might be smarter. Um, might be. Yeah. Might be. <laughs> so, that works. Um, Alright, Larry's gonna come in. Um, Leaf Storm is the better call here. And just get the damage, really. Oh, and it doesn't do really that much. And we see a wish. All right. Um, so we got a wish. That's that's perfect, really. That's really, really, really perfect. Wish is never good. Damn, Leafstrom really didn't do a whole lot. Alright, it's gonna bring Thunderous. Uh, let's see what he goes for. Knockoff. Alright. So Yashabar is gone, which is kind of okay. So that's an interesting set, though, nonetheless. Let's see. And we got Dazzling Gleam, so that's alright. Gonna go for another one of these. I don't really do as much damage as I was kind of aiming for. Odino is definitely fat. Like, surprisingly fat. So, Dazzling Gleam, which is okay. Um, Dazzling Gleam, Wish, Knockoff. Um, either Protect or he has to have um, Call Mind. Uh, I hope he has Call Mind and not Protect. That makes this kind of a never, <laughs> at least easier to manage. He's pushed to a corner though, and luckily for me, 
the knockoff didn't really matter. It would be nice if I had life four, but at the same time, it wouldn't really have mattered for the game anyway. And uh, I am in an area where I think, depending on his set, that I can't kill it, or at least not properly. Uh, Leaf Storm didn't really touch it. Sludge Wave didn't necessarily touch it at 32%. I mean, that's not enough. So I have to rely on Steam Eruption, basically. Uh, let's see. Gets the Poison. Nice. Uh, as it goes, another Dazzling Gleam that does not kill us, luckily. And, uh, yeah, I can just go for T-Bolt here. The question is, what does one of these lock himself into? Um, at this point, I do believe Flare Blitz is a better play. I kind of want to save Differential for this match. But it could predict Southland, and uh, that's never good. Actually, let's try. Let's see if he, I can get him that pleasure. The thing is, I can't not necessarily fend this Mon off anyway. Uh, I need to bring God War in and go for the Moonblast. That's the only way I'm going to kill it. But I'm pretty sure he has to lock himself into Earthquake. If he does that, then fine. That means that we get it. Um, we get the 5-0 anyway. Um, I'm actually not particularly fond of playing on Showdown. Mostly because... Uh, it's kind of speedy, like there are no thought processes, but when a player like um, Danner is playing as fast as I do, I actually get some head or get some momentum here, which is actually kind of nice. Uh, Alright, so he goes for head smash. I'm pretty sure he's locked into that. Um, I have no reason not go. And actually, kind of shut him down. Oh, he missed two times in a row. That is just the worst. That is just the worst. This is a scar set. This actually makes sense for me of actually. Just lock him in, him, and yeah, return is up there. So a tough call for him when we had him locked himself into head smash, and that's a five zero oh, in our victory or in our favor. Um, I don't know what to say. Like I said, very straightforward game. Um, I think Dan actually plays the game right. I do think his team is really good. Um, probably playing Thunders that hard that early was very very dangerous for him. But you know, I get where he's coming from, and I think that was the right call. Uh, me getting up rocks early, yes, it matters a whole lot. It is definitely a factor. Uh, it's definitely a factor. Um, but yeah, outside of that, um, Dan, good job, really. I think, like I said, I think you played this game actually correct. I think it's the right team. Um, I think maybe you should have left, led with Reggie Rock, kind of seeing that Don was my only spinner. I think that would have actually fed me off better. But as it stood, I, I really enjoyed the game. I love these 20 turn games battle. That pretty much is what my team was just designed for. So I'm kind of glad I survived it. Uh, so yeah, for everybody who's been watching, thank you for doing this. So we are actually playing in our playoff now due to this victory, which is kind of crazy, actually. Uh, but yeah, thank you everybody for watching. And yeah, the Gothenburg Guard Shop is in the playoff. Woo! 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 Woo!